Hey, what's happening gamers? Welcome back to another Injustice DLC Gods Among Us episode. As you all know, the sixth character has finally released, and it is Zatanna, Mistress of the Dark Elements, part of a Justice League Dark, and, you know, she's a magician, basically. Well, spellster, sorceress, I don't know. I guess she's even called Zatanna the Sorceress. But what's interesting is she didn't release until about 3 p.m. today on the PlayStation Network, at least on my end, uh, although Zatanna. the Xbox 360 got her um, very early this morning from what I hear. And we're doing the Mortal Kombat DC ladder, of course, and we kick things off with the Batman. Believe it or not, I really don't know all that much about Zatanna, other than I believe that's her voice actress from uh, the animated series. Although it does kind of sound like her Young Justice incarnation. Batman look grumpy. It's because you're wearing the new 52 costume, and the new 52 sucks! Sorry what it does. Thankfully, uh, Zatanna here is wearing her classic costume, the one that everybody knows her as, which is the magician coattails, the boots, and the fishnet stockings. That move leave you cold, Batman? Uh, her combos for the most- ow. Parts. Are a little tricky to pull off. She has some nice ones if you can get a, you know, a starter going. Good juggling, good bounces, but uh, her combos in general are just, for me, they're a pain to pull off. I actually had to practice with her for about uh, 15 minutes before I did this right now because, well, uh, her controls get a little confusing for me because I'm, I'm used to the more Batman and Nightwing characters and she plays completely different. Also, that wand move that you see where I pulled uh, Zatara's hat, or her father's hat, um, those aren't combo moves that you can do when you pull that out. It's just uh, basic, like, uh, long-range attacks and things like that. I'm sorry, I'm a bit preoccupied in my mind right now. I really want to be playing DuckTales, which is amazing, by the way. Even though the game is only two hours long, it is so much fun. Uh, and being a huge fan of DuckTales, I can't think of anything else. So, Zatanna picked a horrible day to release, personally, because <laughs> I, I just want to play that game, man. Uh, still managed to beat the Dark Knight, though. So I can't get in the mindset for doing all this lore. Into the hatch you go. Now, one thing I do remember about Zatanna, though, is she is mostly a Batman character, or at least was, uh, in the 80s. And even in the uh, 2000s, she definitely had a past romantic relationship with the Dark Knight. All that I can remember of Zatanna's original past is that she is the daughter of, I believe his name is Zatara, who was the magician that trained Batman to be an escape artist, basically. In fact, in the animated series episode labeled Zatanna, we uh, see Batman and Zatara, you know, working together, although he uses another alias. And she discovers Batman's secret identity later. But I, I forget what his alias was. It was like John something. So she didn't put two and two together and realize that John is really Bruce Wayne. But she does know Batman's secret identity in a sense. There we go. See, that's a good chain. I, I like that. I'm going to do that more often. In you go. Uh, when she was in that episode, though, since Batman the Animated Series was kind of a more realistic approach for Batman... She wasn't a sorceress. She was just a trickster, a magician. Although later when she appeared in the Justice League Unlimited series, she could do all her backward spells and things like that. That's because Paul Dini was a huge fan of the character. In fact, when he left uh, the WB animation, he went and did a miniseries for Zatanna right before the New 52. It wasn't very popular, but, you know, it's still good writing if you like Dini's work. Man, I'm just cleaning house with Ares. Hocus pocus time. Time to make you disappear, Ares. Booyah. Now, Zatanna's combos, they're... Uh, I don't know. They're a mixed bag. I mean, I really enjoyed playing as Martian Manhunter, but Zatanna, she has a lot of possibilities for advanced players, but I'm neither advanced nor... Casual. Wow, the game was uh, skipping up on me for a second there. That's because it's Mander Woman. And uh, originally when I saw Zatanna, I kind of thought she looked like a man. She still kind of does. So I was uh, going around with different names. Mantana, uh, Manzana, 
Manterra, but I, I, I can't really pick one. You guys can choose. That, that's fine. It's just that NetherRealm Studios, as awesome as they are at making games, they're terrible at making facial features for females. Except for the Arkham City characters that are in this game, like Catwoman and uh, Harley Quinn, where they seem to borrow their facial features from those costumes. Except the Ami, or anime, or whatever, Harley Quinn and Catwoman look terrible, like, face-wise. That's how we do that! Nice 14-hit combo, end with a... What was those? Magic rings to the face? Looked like magic rings. That would make sense, since she's a magician. I know, I'm gonna spam the crap out of this move, and I don't know how to do that. <laughs> Makes for a nice little, uh, combo starter. Oh. Alright, uh, let's see. Nice little sweep there. Oh crap. You're not up to this. Presto, you lose. Presto, I lose, eh? I'm actually going to lose. Yep. You missed. Flame on, baby. Oh wow, I take forever to get there. I've seen her actually use a teleport, but I haven't really figured out how to do that. I think it has to do with uh, pressing the X button, maybe up and down. Oh crap. Not what I'm ever worried about. I'm winning. Winning! Boom, baby. And finish with rings to the face. Nice. Magic is easy as one, two, three. And of course, that hat that you see right there has a lot of uh, magical abilities since it was her father's hat. Uh oh. Hal Jordan. Is it going to be Jon Stewart or Hal Jordan? We'll find out. Believe it or not, my wife actually knows a lot more about Zatanna than I do. The only thing I remember her from is Identity Crisis, where she played a very vital role in the Justice League. There was something happening where she ended up erasing the minds of everyone involved with something with a Sue Danby, I believe her name was. Even Batman's mind got erased, so it made kind of like this awkwardness between him and his former love interest, Zatanna. And later when he found out, that was kind of what made him do the OMCs, or whatever they're called, and uh, go against the Justice League that we saw in Justice League Doom, is because he really started to distrust the League. And even though he and Zatanna patched things up eventually, he never really looked at her the same way again. But uh, if you people are wondering, she definitely was a love interest for Batman in the 80s, and again, I believe in the 2000s, just briefly. And you definitely saw that love interest aspect in the animated series and Justice League. Although they were more like old lovers instead of current ones. Because Batman had to think for Wonder Woman. Missed! <laughs> Rings. I love that. Alright, I'm actually... I think I should try to do my super. Oh! Yeah, I can see that, Hal. Let's see, how do we... wonder what our super is. If it's long... Long range or close. Oh. There we go. And that got him. Pretty cool so far. Backwards stock. Ah, oh, this is kind of a lame super. But she did the uh, backwards spell thing. Ouch! Okay, now focus. Oh, crap. I'm sorry, Hal, but you lose. Can I skip this? Nope. Pressing the button, nothing's happening. All I have on the mind is do 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 do. In fact, if you guys want to watch that, uh, feel free to. It's in the uh, description below. Apparently, awesome d -d dude is now online, and we're versing Flashpoint Aquaman. It's go time, Fishman. Begin. Oh. What was that one combo? Oh, never mind. It wasn't that! Apparently that was a Oh, come on! Dude! Uh, any of you uh, people paying attention to the whole Trinity War? I haven't really read it because I've heard rumors that Nightwing is gonna die. So I really don't care anymore. I've just uh, ordered a bunch of back issues of Nightwing. Um, so... Oh, come on! There we go. It's cheap, but effective. I don't like her 
walk, though. Oh, he blocked it. So apparently it can be guarded down and away. Okay. <laughs> Fooled you. Ow. Oh, you meant that, eh? You meant that, Philomar? I'm really tired of people thinking that Philomar isn't the voice of Jon Stewart. He so is. I don't know where people got that uh, information wrong, but Philomar is legendary as doing that voice. And the voice of Samurai Jack. Sorry, Phil. No hard feelings, man. You're awesome. But I have to beat you. He still makes a pretty good Aquaman, though. I really liked him in Young Justice, and I think he does a good job in the Injustice series. That's a nice uh, starter move, by the way, and the rings make a good way to finish. Especially from a distance. Magic is easy as one, two, two, three. And I thought stay down was annoying. <laughs> this is worse. If they had to do an alternate costume, I, I would like to see her superhero cape version. Uh-oh. Versus the Joker. I really love reading the Injustice forums, and a lot of people were ticked off about it, uh, Zatanna being in this game. They were like, no more Batman characters! And it's like, she's not really a Batman character. She had daddy issues in her uh, original creation, and it wasn't until the 80s had their own New 52 where she became the love interest of Batman during his training days. And kind of worked in Gotham, and... Bold Haven and different places like in the Batman worlds, but she was still her own character. She's worked with Constantine and was a valued member of the Justice League, so I mean, she, she's basically her own thing. I personally like her moveset better in Justice League Heroes, which I would love to look at, but I have a broken PS2, so I have no way of doing that. Oh, come on, Red Hood. And yeah, that's Red Hood, not the Red Hood that you guys and gals want. I think Ed Boon totally, like, <laughs> he's, like, spammed everybody thinking that, ouch, thinking that uh, Jason Todd would be in this game. I would still love to see it, but I think he would be better in Injustice 2, which, based on this game alone, they should stop making all these DLC characters. Because the game now has to cost people like close to two hundred dollars by now, so I don't like you. I don't like you either. Oh, um, see, the one's really not. Ow, ow. The one's not really good for combos. It's just like super moves and stuff like that. Combos is all about the fast and furious feet. Her throw is still pretty cool, though. You done, son. Woot. Magic is easy as one, two, three. Shazam. Oh, what's inside the hat? I was hoping for her super that she would call, like, a, a killer rabbit out of the hat and just start, like, laying waste to everybody. Oh, crap. I'm fighting my best character. This is gonna suck. I really don't know what version of Zatanna this is supposed to be. Uh, maybe there'll be some type of interaction between Nightwing and Zatanna, considering they were dating in Young Justice. Well, I mean, Robin and Begin. Zatanna were. And Zatanna was the same age as Dick Grayson. Well, mostly. She was a teenager. But we really didn't see her in the second season. She appeared, like, briefly a little bit as a member of the League, but she didn't really have an important role, which I think some fans were upset by that. The second season was all about the team that was still in the Titans. Like Aqualad, Nightwing, Superboy, and McGann. I like that uh, card trick. How'd I do that? Was that like back? Hang on a sec, I'm trying to think. Bad dick. Oh, I can't remember it. Oh, Ooh, that's a cool move, I like that. It's a nice little fake out. Oh, crap. Um. Yeah, no, I need to get better distance away. No! Alright, it's over. He blocked it! Why? Oh, this is bad. This is very, very bad. Okay, okay. Oh. Stop it, Richard. Alright, I need to concentrate for a second or I'm gonna lose. 
Nightwing can easily uh, turn the tide. You are so gonna regret oh, come on! Presto, you lose. And all she says is, presto, you lose? That's lame. At least when he interacted with other DLC characters, there was something different to say. But nothing between him and Zatanna? Really? Whatever. It's over. How do you like me? Ah, snap. Got cocky. Crap! This might be over, folks. Nope, I got him. Boom, baby. Man. Is it just me or is her, her attacks not quite as strong? It's almost like playing as Batgirl, except she's not that easy to control combat-wise, and she leaves herself open a lot. Some of her attacks are really slow, and other attacks are really fast. I have a feeling that this fight against Bane is going to be tough. I can't tell if this is actually a model of Arkham City in the background, but we are fighting Nightfall Bane. I haven't really fought a, a brute character in this yet. This is going to be interesting. Or, excuse me, a power character? Crap. Okay, let's just keep him away. Nice little combo. I like that. How'd I do that? <laughs> I love throwing the rings at people. It's great. Oh, snap. Why didn't it blow up? Why didn't it blow up? Don't tell me, I don't, as a gadget character, I, I don't have the ability to blow it up. That sucks. Oh, see, that's why that sucks. Ugh, I missed it. I missed it. Crap. All right. All right, so this is a little, uh, little tough. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Why didn't it do it? I messed it up. I'm doomed. Just calm down. Everything's gonna be okay. All right, get some good distance. Throw rings. I threw a ring at his face. More venom. No more venom. I threw a ring at your face, dude. I just threw more rings, and it bounced off you like nothing. Crap. Oh man, should I try to use the wand? My attacks aren't doing squat against him. Ah. This is not looking good. You're just gonna keep backing me in the corner, aren't you, dude? Yes, do the super. Even the. Oh snap. Oh, man, come on! Against Bane? You know nothing of strength. And you know nothing of Bane. Bane sounds like this. Like a gentleman, not a thug. Well, actually, the Christopher Nolan version of Bane sounds like... Whatever. Uh, I still like how Bane sounds in the Arkham City series. Although I, th I thought his voice was really cool in that first episode of uh, Batman the Animated Series, labeled Bane. That was a cool voice. The guy that got to replace him, it didn't really work with the animation style that they chose. And they went with a... Kind of his comic book look, but not really. I've never really been a fan of the, the luchador mask. I like Bane like looking like this, because it's a little bit scarier, you know? You can't see the guy's facial expressions. He's behind, like, this evil-looking mask, and that's the same mask he wore when he, uh, broke Batman. Like that! Come on, Bane. Lose! Please? Alright, I'm gonna need to play smart here. How did I do that teleporter? It was, like, down X, A. Down, down up X. Nope, that's not it. Hang on a sec. Come on, Bane, give me a chance to learn my moves, dude. Nope, that's not it. Nope. Nope. Uh. Wasn't that funny, punk? Nope. There we go. Okay, do that again. Now get behind him. There we go. All right. Time to do a little bit of strategy here, pal. Have a nice trip. Boom, baby. I'm a crafty Zatanna. That's gonna work in my favor. All right, let's go, you big bruiser. You had to break my combo. Presto, you lose. I'm getting so tired of Presto, you lose. Presto, you lose, see? Eat rings to the face, rings to the face, and trash can. <laughs> gotcha, Bane. Cheap tactic, but it worked. You lose. Magic is easy as one, two, not you! Oh, sneeze. I don't know. 
Uh, you gave me 115 losses total, Bane. I hate you. Aw, oh, snap. Come on, give me a break. Scorpion? I don't think I can beat Scorpion. Finish him. Oh, he will. He will. Your soul will burn. Probably. Alright, let's attempt this. Oh, come on! Ah, I didn't get that chain in. That's gonna hurt me. Who's that? Ah! Uh, punk. You missed! I didn't. Eat rings to the face! Ring. Blocked. Oh, come on! Why? I... Well, that's not really what I want to do, but okay. Chill out, dude. Ring. <laughs> I love that, I'm sorry. Oh yeah, I can breathe fire- Ow. I can breathe fire, too. See? Oh. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm technically not burning, but okay. Ha! Ah! Never mess with a magical chick. Ah! He doesn't seem to care that you're a magical chick. He uses magic too. There we go. Keep it going. Keep the chain going. That barely did any damage to him. You gotta be kidding me. I'm getting psyched out here. Scorpion's gonna beat me just by intimidating me. Crap. Oh yeah. I missed! Oh no! Oh no! This is bad. This is bad, folks. Um, oh. I'm just gonna block everything. What kind of move can I do against him then? Not that one. Oh, he, he blocked it. Oh, he did the wager. Wanna see a trick? Oh, you said something different. I'm impressed. And you didn't lose. You got a chance. What are you doing? Uh, it didn't do the move. It didn't do the kick. I had him. I had him. Oh, that's going to leave a mark. Whee! Dead. Hey, pal. Remove your foot. Perv. All right. Rematch there, sunshine. All right, that was not all warm and fuzzy. No finish. Let's do this. Now you face the might of a woman scorned. Actually, it's probably a woman. It might be an it. Yeah, I'm pretty much probably a woman. Ring to the face. Oh, I thought I dodged. No, 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 no. I like that combo, but it really doesn't do... Mm. You're enjoying this way too much, aren't you, Scorpion? Okay, so I burn you, then you burn me. That's that's funny. Still got you. And the odds are in my favor, somewhat. Spoke too soon. Come on! Punch him in the face! Don't dodge it. Yes! I get to use my sucky super. Backwards. Boom. I don't know, how many of you actually liked Zatanna in Young Justice? I thought she was okay. I totally can't think at the moment. It's like, why did they have to pick this character? I hardly know anything about her. And Amber's out, uh, probably a Kohl's. Goodbye, wallet. Oh. Take that! That didn't feel nice, did it? Hmm. I finally used the cards! That was cool! But I didn't get to really enjoy it. There we go. Pick a card and- oh. I'm still not on fire. That car in the background is. Yeah, with a ring to the face. Jump. Magic is easy as one, two, seven. Three. Ah, I didn't mess her up. I'm getting a little annoyed. I've lost twice so far. Um... This, this may be the worst uh, ladder episode ever. I'm not liking this character at all. It's not at all. Now I have to face an evil dictator wearing a diaper. Superman. Oh, he's got 
Yeah, he's got this all right. This is gonna be a slaughter. <laughs> mm. Takes your breath away, doesn't it? Not in the way that I intended. Ring the face! Had to get my... Ow. I guess he didn't want to do... Oh, come on! I threw you first! You, that's what you get! Get slapped with some silver rings and a deck of cards. Yeah. I forgot all my combos. I'm screwed. There we go. An oldie goody goody. And I missed! Uh. The only reason Superman's so strong is that stupid shield movie does where he, like, glows red. I think that's why John is, like, pretty much unbeatable, too. Because those stretchy arms are awesome. Zatanna doesn't have that cool, glowy thing. She pulls out a stupid wand. Oh, well. Um, that, that was a face block, ladies and gentlemen. I'm really getting angry by the uh, diaper wonder here. <laughs> diaper of tomorrow. Seriously, why would he have a red diaper? It, it, it just, it looks like some, I, I don't know. Like a geriatric diaper. Oh, I'm sorry, did I touch a nerve? Diaper man! Ow. What? Oh, you, you planned that, didn't you? Well, I planned this. Gibberish. Okay. No! I will have order. Presto, you lose. No, you just jinxed yourself, lady. Told you. <laughs> At least you didn't let him enjoy his victory very long. I'm gonna have to incorporate that into my uh, daily moves, just taking out a pair of silver rings and throwing them at people's faces. I love that, I'm sorry. I know it's cheap, but it's great. Oh. I'm losing it here. Yeah, that didn't do squat. Ring. Ooh. Ah. I prefer to stand. Yeah, uh, for new players, especially, I wouldn't say I'm a new player, but if you're interested in picking up the Zatanna DLC, uh, make sure you practice her a lot. Uh, her combos go from everything from like Raiden to uh, kind of Guile. There are some like Street Fighter moves, like for Ryu and Ken and stuff like that, but she's not a character that really meshes well for me. I, I prefer more the uh, Street Fighter Ryu characters to use in fighting games, because their move sets are easier for me to use. I don't, I've never liked the back forward or back up and down, and that's what Zatanna is. And the easy to do combo that she has, it really doesn't take that much damage, because she's, I guess maybe because she's a woman, either that or she's not a power character. We haven't really seen a very cool power character. All the women are basically gadget characters. I'd like to see Power Girl in this, because then at least, Maybe we'd have a clone of Superman with a different move set. Hopefully. <laughs> uh, that's not going to come in handy at all. Still, ring to face made me feel nice. Eat rings, you missed. Ring. <laughs> no way this is going to be a comeback kid episode. Uh uh. Do it, do it, do it. He blocked. I hate you so much! I finally remembered one of my other combos. Too late. Oh yeah, thanks for that. I don't want to. You kneel. Yeah, this is definitely the episode where I've lost the most, and I'm starting to get pretty angry, actually. <laughs> The only solace in my mind at the moment is, after this, I get to play DuckTales. So let's beat Soup so I can be done with this horrible, horrible... Ugh. Die! Missed me. Not that time, though. What are you doing? It looks like you're getting ready for the Olympic skiing event. Oh, that teleport didn't go as according to plan. Hold still, this won't hurt me a bit. What? I was in the middle of an unbreakable move, and he can freeze me during an unbreakable move. Wow. 
Patch, please. Welcome to the pain train, Mr. Diaper Man. Man of Steel, I'm gonna turn you into the man. Ow. Oh, come on! No! Never give up, never surrender! Especially not to likes of you! Alright, even up now there, monkey. You had to block. Well, you've been doing that so far. Try something new. Ugh. Ring to face, miss. No. I'm gonna be cheap, I promise. No, 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 no. Come on. It's not like I erased your memory. <laughs> he fell for it, that was great. Oh. High and mighty Superman tripped. That was awesome. Ball's in my court now, Soupies. I will have order. Wanna see a trick? Ah! Winning. Ring. Ring out. Oh. Come here. I want to throw you. You made me really angry. Yes! Uppercut for the win. You're done. So long, Huggies. Memories. Your soul is mine. Bye bye. Well, I feel vindicated. A little angry, but definitely vindicated. Oh, uh, wow. What can I say about Zatanna? Well, after her story, I'll tell you. The defeat of Superman was a relief to Zatanna. During the regime, she and Dr. Fate had taken advantage of Superman's vulnerability to magic and turned the Tower of Fate into a sanctuary for Superman's enemies. She had saved many lives, but years of subterfuge weighed heavily upon her. After the regime's downfall, Zatanna was instrumental in restraining metahumans during their trials. But when a jury recommended the death penalty for the more immutable defendants, Zatanna intervened. Immutable? She took the prisoners to the Tower of Fate. There they would remain, incarcerated, but alive. So, if the Tower of Fate is in, in this, uh, where's Dr. Fate? Just saying. Uh, anyway gamers, how do I think about Zatanna? She's okay DLC, but she's definitely not one of my favorite characters. Um, I would put her probably, uh, fourth in, in the DLC characters that I've played. I would even probably put Lobo above her. I, I just, I don't know. The, I don't really like her moveset at all. Um, but I'm sure with a more skilled player, you know, she's probably a better character, but she just goes all over the place for me, and I don't really like that. And she has some great potential, but, um, from what I've seen, I don't know if she's actually worth buying or not. <laughs> I really, I really don't. I'll have to see what Amber does with the character. But anyway, that's gonna conclude this episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you want something else to do, check out DuckTales in the description below. I'll see you next time with another DLC Injustice. God bless and happy gaming.